Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. Are you looking to make your paladin stand out from those around you? Then look no further, as I showcase my five favorite and most used paladin glamours. Thank you all for 1900 subscribers, and without further ado, let's get into it. Let's begin strong with my most recent style, the Palace Guard. Making good use of the Augmented, Crendendum Curious Offending, Dyed Pure White, matched with the Undyed Limbo Van Braces, and the rather nice Limbo Skirt. For the legs, I went with the Darbar Boots Offending. Painted grey, they match the colour scheme perfectly, with the armour sharing a similar design. For the weapons of choice, I went with the Tropios Sword and Shield, as they were just too perfect of a fit. Secondly, we have a lighter weight design. I shall name this one the Traveller, this time rocking the Signia's Jerkin from the Mog Station. This is honestly one of the nicest chess pieces in the game, and combines well with the Pantheon arms and boots. I added the Direwolf Cusis Offending for its chainmail look, and for the blade, I went with the stylish Edencore Bastard Sword, bringing the whole design together with the Hellhound Shield. Next, something for you OG players, the Warrior Reborn. If like myself you enjoyed the Armor of Light from back in the day, you will surely enjoy the updated and diable version from PvP. This armor is one of the most unique and standout amongst the tanking sets, and pairs nicely with the Heaven Ward relics, Aetea Lux and Prewen Lux. For you raid lovers out there, I have a mix and match for you. I shall call this the Highborn, with the Theogonic male as the centerpiece painted grey, and both the hypostatic arms and legs painted pure white, once again combined with the Limbo skirt and the Tropius sword and shield. Not only does this set stand out, this has the feeling as if you are a knight of nobility. Saving the best for last, we have my personal favourite, which I have been rocking for many years. Let's call this Honorbound, as the set has quite the samurai style of build. This armour looks amazing in ruby red, and is one of only a few armour sets to have a different style on each arm. The Akaoni set can be acquired through PvP, and is the ideal set for the Mitsuba Kai shield, with the Hakama 55 legs being a perfect fit. Decide for yourself which one was your favourite. Feel free to let me know down below. Thanks for watching, and I shall see you all in the next one.